היום אנחנו מארחים את ריצ'רד הנדריקס שחזר אלינו לקבוצה. הכנו לו כמה שאלות, אז בואו נתחיל. How's this week was for you? Uh, this week's been great, you know, it's, uh, it was a little bit of a transition to get back here, but I'm happy to be back. Happy to see a bunch of old friends and uh, happy to get to work. Uh, how was it to meet your old friends, Pnini or Yugev? You know, it's great. You know, you, you come to the locker room, you see so many familiar faces. And uh, I was received with a warm reception. And uh, to get back on the court, some of the things that I remember from four years ago just seemed to click automatically. So uh, I'm looking forward to it. Did you get to know Tabak from Spain? I have um, played against his teams before, and I remember him when he was the assistant coach um, uh, years ago in the past, so I've, I've always remembered competing against his team, but um, I'm, I'm glad to be here and, and competing with him. Are you familiar with his system? Well, there's some things that are similar to what, um, to what I was just used to in Spain that he's doing in the practices, so um, that helps to make, to make things adjust a little bit faster. But at the same time, I'll have to take my pace to kind of learn, and, and hopefully I can catch up and get up to speed as fastly as possible. When you landed, you said uh, it's very important to keep with the uh, Maccabi spirit. What are your thoughts about it? My two seasons here, it was uh, the atmosphere was something that was contagious. I learned uh, immediately when I joined the team what the club represented, the expectations that they had, and the, um, the goals that they wanted to achieve. And uh, for me, um, you know, coming back, I think that's the same spirit that I hope that, that the team continue to have. And I hope that we can achieve the goals that we set out to do. And uh, I just want to be a part of it. What did you miss most about uh, Maccabi? The fans. I, I think um, this is uh, one of the best home court advantages in Europe. And uh, you miss playing in an atmosphere that is so electric every single night. And uh, you truly feel like you have an extra teammate on the court. when you play in front of so many passionate fans. And I'm, I'm looking forward and hoping to, that those fans have the same passion when uh, we get back on the court and can help push the team to the heights that we all want to be. I heard you're a new father. Is that true? This is true. This is true. So uh, like I said earlier, a lot of things have changed. It's a big responsibility. You know, I always felt like um, you know, just playing basketball was a big responsibility. But this is a whole other level. And it's a bigger challenge than what I've ever had. But, um, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm happy to have this challenge. I've embraced it. And I think it's, uh, it can make me a better person. And hopefully it can contribute to make me a better uh, professional and basketball player as well. What should we expect from you on Monday in Jerusalem? I'm looking forward to the Jerusalem game. I think that uh, everyone is. We know that it's a very important game. You know, I haven't had the time to uh, develop a chemistry with the entire team yet and learn the system. But um, I have confidence in myself that I know how to play basketball. And I think um, even without another game to play before it, I think that I can be prepared to do what I need to do to help our team to have the best chance to win the game. What's your physical shape? I'm in good condition. Um, you know, I'm ready. You know, I've, I've missed a few days to, to train with the team during my transition here. But uh, I think day by day I'm getting up to speed. play hard, then I think that we will uh, have a chance to do what we want to do. Thank you very much. 